something around it. Okay, we're interviewing our friend Tucker Tucker Wyatt today, and we have a surprise for him. A piñata taco. Homeless taco filling. Yeah. With so lion, Goodbye. <laughs> Tito Plenty one time. I used to be Tito Plenty and, <laughs> and any other bad word that you can think of. I've probably been called that too. Cabron. I call it evil. And <laughs> little bastard. Yeah. We call you Tacolito behind your back. Okay, all the time. Good. That's something more out with that. Yeah. That's what Amy calls me. Amy calls you Tacolito? Awesome. Well, happy birthday! Thanks. Thank you for joining us. Um, we have no idea what to ask you or what to do. Give him his oh, birthday, birthday present. Birthday One of them. You. Um, from us to you. Is this a magnet? Oh, what is it? It's a oh, gel it's a cling. Gel, you cling it on shit. Awesome. Dog ear floating about. <laughs> <laughs> put it on my guitar. Oh, yeah. That would be awesome. <laughs> Um, speaking, well, of, speaking of guitars, we'll talk about that later. <laughs> um, thanks for in inviting us into your house. We love it. Thanks for coming over. Yeah. Where did you? How long did it take you to collect all these awesome treasures? Um, yeah, not that long. No, is it also the past stuff? seven seven years? <laughs> um, Traveling antiques. I think most of it I got here in town. Yeah. All this crap, stuff I don't need. Oh no, it's all beautiful. I know. How long have you been living in Sanch? Uh, most of my life. I moved. I left after I got out of college, and then I came back about. I came back like ten years ago, I guess. Oh, we all come back. <laughs> it's the toilet bowl effect. Yeah. Um, well, since, sorry. Since you've been back here, um, Sanchez has been growing a lot. What is your favorite thing that you've seen that's like this change yeah. the radical change in San Angelo. Uh, the downtown stuff. It's nice, right? Yeah. Usually, well, when I got back here, it was the dead horse wasn't even open yet. Yeah. And then the dead horse opened, and it was still a ghost town. Like on Saturday night, there'd be no one. Just and then all of a sudden, all the stuff started happening. It's still yeah. happening, which is good. Yeah. Yeah. And the definitely. arts are getting better, which is good for me. I know, and me. Yeah. <laughs> to make the money. Yeah, seriously. Yeah, um, I love San Angelo too. Um, the downtown is one of my favorite things. Um, the art scene is taking forever to grow, but I think it's it. I think it's as artists are like introverted, so nobody communicates and can put shit together. Well, that, everybody. Nobody young leaves. Mm -hmm. It's true. <laughs> I mean, that's why I left. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I left when I was young too, but I came back. I love San Angelo. Um, ever since we've been doing this, um, we've found a lot of gems and treasures in town, so we like it. Yeah. Yeah. Have you um, gone to that cact cactus town? No, not yet. I've been by there. I've been meaning to go for a couple years. It's Still super rad. There. You'll love it. Yeah. Um, the guy that owns it told us to go back in April um, when everything's in bloom. Spring, yeah. yeah. But he has like it's a huge land, and he has antiques and um, cactus succulents, and he has like rocks and minerals. He's super rad guy. You guys are going to be best friends, probably. <laughs> yeah. Um, so I've known Taco since, I don't remember, but I met him at the bar. 
<laughs> at some point. I don't even. Dead horse open. I don't even remember like how we officially met, but you kind of all become Our friends. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Osmosis. Drinks. I remember <laughs> when I first met Tucker. <laughs> it was, I mean, Taco. Tacolito. Tacolito. Um, Radical Taco. It was when Hastings was originally in where um, Planet Fitness is. And there was a Halloween <laughs> rock show outside and everybody oh, was playing yeah. like <laughs> all this. I don't know. But, that, was um, long, that was like, I was in college then. Was it like a punk show? It was or the late middle? 90s. Yeah. I think 90s. it was metal. It was. It was metal, yeah. <laughs> Nigel really does have a good metal scene. It's crazy. It's <laughs> <is> cool. <laughs> so that was a while back. So Taco Gosh, has been yeah. in our life forever. Um, and I actually live in the duplex that Tucker used to live in. So that's nice. Thanks for leaving it in good condition. Oh, you bet. I still you use bet. that little stove every day. <laughs> yeah. Good. Yeah, it's from the 50s or some shit. But it, I the love that born. stove. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that thing will put out the heat. <laughs> yes. So, um, yeah, so Tucker's been our friend forever. We love him. Happy birthday. Um, what else do you do? Taco is like a renaissance man. He does everything. He's an artist. He's a musician, um, a gardener. How'd you... Jackass of all trades. Jackass, yeah. Um, I've only seen Tucker play once um, at the Dead Horse. And when I first heard... The Harlots. <laughs> yeah, and uh, the first time I heard you sing, I was like, what the hell? Like that big old voice coming out of Tucko, that's awesome. <laughs> yeah, so you're you guys are awesome. We're gonna get back together. I don't I don't know. Probably maybe never, I don't know. <laughs> you guys get back together you. once a, every five years? No, that was when you saw us play was the second like second reunion and <laughs> We played like two gigs for that, and that was with a different. We didn't have our original bass. I was player. gonna say, as the original members, the original drummer. And if we did it again, which I could probably get him to do it, we would have our original bass player, and it would be cool. We could still do it. We still know the songs, but they live. The drummer's in New Braunfels, and um, the kid Jason Spencer lives somewhere around there. I can't remember. Still where. around. Sam Marcus <laughs> Uh, well, if you ever do a reunion show, let us know. Uh, yeah, everybody will know. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Maybe we should put something together. Right. We should make that happen. <laughs> yeah. You should really watch Bob's Burgers. It's fucking funny. It's hilarious. Yeah. Okay, so let's see. What did we talk about? We talked about your music life. We talked about how we met. Um, what about the gardening? Have you always had the green thumb? Is that what you call it? I guess. Yeah. I just <clears throat> like doing it as growing up, so I do it. Like as a kiddo, did you get into it like with your parents? Did they garden and shit? Or something? No, you just my dad it? did, my, and my grandparents, but I didn't do it with them really. I just, as I got older, I guess from watching, I started doing it for, it's for fun. Yeah, you're really good at it. Like you have mm-hmm. a fucking jungle in your backyard. It's a garden. It's a garden. <laughs> the garden of a taco. <laughs> the taco garden. Yeah. I have a taco tree out there and fresh tacos. Yes. Just like this one. Yum. I'm going to steal some on the way out. <laughs> so we had a question for you. Mm-hmm. You know, um, we've been doing this vlog for a little while, but we have yet vlog. to have like an intro for ourselves. So we wanted to know if you would just do like a... Grab your guitar and write us a intro song real quick for us on the fly. Mm-hmm, on the fly. Bust it out. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> intro song. Yeah, so before you do that, um, describe us in three words, collectively. Oh, yeah. Maybe that'll help you write the song. Bat shit crazy. That is one of the... <laughs>
the rules. We just want to um, get the beast so he could be on there because he'll bring in the ladies. <laughs> yeah. Hi, sweet baby. Will you um, show us some of your art? Sure. sure. It's everywhere. I, mean, I picked up that piece earlier. I love it. What do you call this piece? Naked lady face. With yes. a big butt. That's a good That's butt. A nice. Let me zoom on yeah. that. <laughs> Who's your inspiration for this? Georgia Gap. Look at that. <laughs> what? <laughs> Interesting. That's real good. Did you make that too? Yeah. There's some pottery, a vessel. Yeah. Raccoon. That's rad. I have, um, I saw, I have that little bird. Thank you for that. Oh, yeah. That's, that's badass. That's Jillian Rose. Another vessel. The famous one. Ooh. Her naked. Well, I guess she, it's naked in my mind. She's naked? <clears throat> she doesn't have clothes on. That's true. Oh, you know. The face. Look at <laughs> what? So pretty. Yeah. I was thinking this was the face because it looks like the hair was yeah. fucking perspective. That's awesome. That is red. And Amy paints and does all kind of shit too. You guys are power art couple. I wish you would film with us. Oh. Hoo -hoo. Yeah. <laughs> I love you. Love owls. I see another owl over there. You know, like making birds and stuff. Yeah. Red. Plant her with no plant. Because all the things in West Texas are dead right now. <laughs> I used to have a plan. I took it out. I'm going to put something else in it. Yeah. A new a succulent. Oh, look. It had a candy in there. He poor. <laughs> yeah. It's the best. I love it. Where'd you get this red guy at? Oh, uh, hobo. Uh, that was uh, my grandpa's, which he probably got out of his pawn shop. He had Nettons Pawn when I was a kid. He's the one that lived in that underground house down here. Really? So says, yeah, he had that built in like 81. That's that awesome. Was, when he walked, it was like at the top of the stairwell, or at the eye level when you're at the top of the stairwell. Uh -huh. Went down to the end of the house. I mean, it was there, and when he died, I got it. He acquired that. That's bad. <laughs> Everybody likes it more than anything else I've ever done. <laughs> I mean, because it's fucking rad. Cool, yeah. I wish I knew who that person it. was. Yeah. yeah, I want to fucking stitch it now. He's like the epitome of a West Texas hobo. Yep. Rad. In the dirt. I don't See? have anywhere to go. Cool. And that Bella's cotton candy. This is my birthday earlier. Oh, that was nice. Badass. Oh, do you have plans for your B day? No, not really. <laughs> Well, we have another something special surprise for you, too. Good birthday surprise. It's going to be a good one. A little desolate. There's onions growing over there and garlic, carrots, more onions. I planted potatoes yesterday. Oh, awesome. Oh, I like that moon. The star is cool. Did you make the moon? Yeah, it was a piece of round plywood we found. It used to be a sign, so I cut a moon shape and a star. Badass. Oh, I'm sorry. Ah. Somebody <laughs> made you a taco pinata. For your birthday! Beautiful. But uh, it's full of stuff that we Presents. put in prizes for you. So we want to go find a tree, hang it up, and have you bust it. Yeah, also, do you have a stick? Yeah, we couldn't find one. Yeah, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Found this down at San Rita Park the other day. Sweet. Sticking in the ground like that. That's some some kid probably <laughs> lost it. <laughs> Hopefully they stay open. For real. I mean, don't stab me. <laughs> I don't even know what to say. Practice. <laughs> I'm not sure if I made it right. It's our first pinata. We first time.
Okay. Like a... We play the game, what's the face you make when, dot, 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 dot. So. So, I want you to look in the camera and give us the face you make when you go to check the mail and realize you don't have pants on. <laughs> <laughs>